I'm in Bathurst today in a um, Airbnb and they've got some magpies around here. But they um, they won't take out of my hand because they don't know me. But they seem pretty tame. Yeah. This one's missing most of the top of its beak. And a bit of the bottom too. Come on, you can have some? Come on. That one looks pretty scruffy. What about you, buddy? You want some? Come on, you want some? You've only got bread. You guys seem to like it. Come on, mate. You want some? Here we go. Come and get it. This one's a shy one. You want some? Come on. All the other ones have got bread. This one's got bread. He's uh, one up here in the clothesline. And he's looking a bit scruffy. These ones look very scruffy compared to the ones at my house. There's another one over there. They seem pretty happy. Been doing lots of singing. Quite a big family. There's six of them here. Oh, I can hear another one behind me, so seven. Oh, here's number seven. Ah, oh. so that one there is the runt. Get picked on. Oh, this one's a bit of a boss. I know, he's just running away with his food. Actually, there's eight. I can see eight. It's quite a big family. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I think I can hear one behind me up in the tree somewhere. No, there's only eight. Anyway, yeah, it's good to see a big family. They're cute. That one with the manky beak. It's had a bit, uh, been in the wars a little bit. Anyway, they're all, all had something to eat now, so they're not too keen on coming close. Yeah, I can hear some in the tree behind me. There's more than eight. Well, these must be like all of the adolescents, like the pack of adolescents. Because what I understand is there's usually a mating pair and they have baby, one or two babies. And when the babies get old enough, they get chased away by the parents. And quite often all of the adolescents, they form their own little group. And I'm pretty sure this is one of those groups because there's lots of them. And this one looks like he's been in lots of fights barely got any beak at all. Check out the top beak. There's not much left. Those feathers look pretty bad too. You want some, mate? And they quite like bread. The ones that uh, the ones in Sydney don't seem to be too keen on bread. Maybe they've been spoilt. Another one's just flown up on the top of the building there. This one looks hungry. Do you want some? Come on. Oh, this one's the shy one. Maybe I need to throw it a bit closer to him. Or her. There we go. Run away. Run away, run away. This one's greedy. Already had a bit. Got some more. Alright, that's probably enough. What I'm going to do, I'm going to leave this bit here. And I'm going to walk away. 
and see who grabs it. What are these guys doing? What are they doing? Never seen that before. <laughs> what is he doing? Just eating bark. Maybe it's a love ritual. Probably. And someone watching too. Look at these two. Something in that box they like. It looks like they live around here because there's lots of poo. So they must hang out here at night. This one looks like the boss. He's the boss. He's the alpha. Yeah, I reckon they live here. Oh, okay, they got a little water bowl there. Let's give them some water. Trouble with the zoom here. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's going to get a drink. Yeah, they don't seem to be needing to be somewhere else, they just sort of hang around here. So, this is their home. They were all singing when we arrived, and they're all still here, just doing what they do. One one's Manky Beak, another one over there, so... Anyway, maybe I'll say hello to them tomorrow as well. See you next time.